trespassing. Water is an important resource, but we may not think about how much water we consume every day. The city of Minot is working on expanding its water treatment tanks and Carissa Stinchcomb joins us in studio to tell us why that's so needed. Thanks, Lauren. The city of Minot treats 12 million gallons of water every day, in turn providing 70,000 people with clean water. But Minot is expanding and these tanks aren't enough. From the city of Minot, it goes out to a, there's about three different rural water systems, all seasons rural water, Upper Surus and North Prairie. There is a 6 million gallon tank from 1951 and a 12 million gallon tank from the 1960s. The city is adding two more tanks to double the treatment capacity to 36 million gallons. This is just making this plant a little more resilient, you know, for dry temperatures. You know, we're still limited on our production capacity because of our wells, you know, but now we have a, a new up-to-date treatment facility. Last week, construction crews hit a water main while working on the flood protection project. People across the river had brown water for a couple of days. The expansion means more water for unexpected situations like that. Water is a, a precious commodity and you, always, you know, people don't realize how important it is until it's not there. You know, and you know, we very seldom get calls here of people saying, you know, I turned on my tap today and there is a plentiful supply of water, thank you. It's usually the latter. I turned on my tap and it wasn't there. What are you guys doing? People in rural communities will also benefit from the take expansion project. Well, whenever you can have more storage, it's a benefit to everybody. The residents, whether you're rural or whether you're city. The more storage you have, the more longevity you have, the better it is for everybody, the less chance that they're going to be, their water service is going to be interrupted. So it's a benefit to everybody. There's a, now to help eliminate overwatering, there's a probe you can buy that measures the moisture in your grass. I'm sure you've seen people watering uh, their grass while it's raining. It's just another way to help conserve water during these summer months. Lauren, back to you. Carissa reporting live. Thank you very much. North Prairie Rural Water was